Seven things you should never do when taking magnesium. Number seven, overdosing. Magnesium is a crucial mineral for our health, and we've talked about it here on our channel before. It plays a vital role in muscle function, bone health, and much more. However, to make the most of magnesium's benefits, it's essential to use it correctly. Today, I'll highlight the 10 most common things you should avoid when taking magnesium to ensure you get all the benefits of this valuable supplement for your body. Stay tuned as mistake number two might be sabotaging your gains and be sure to like this video. Overdosing on magnesium can be a serious health mistake. Just like with everything in life, moderation is key. Taking magnesium is no different. If you overdose on magnesium, you may experience some side effects in your body, such as diarrhea, which is one of the most common side effects of too much magnesium. This happens because magnesium has a laxative effect when taken in large amounts. This effect can cause abdominal discomfort and frequent trips to the bathroom, which can be quite bothersome. Another common effect of incorrect magnesium dosing is frequent nausea. Taking a high dose of magnesium can irritate the gastrointestinal tract, leading to feelings of nausea. This can make you feel unwell and even cause vomiting, making supplementation uncomfortable and reducing the desired gains from the supplement. Abdominal cramps are also common with incorrect magnesium dosing and can worsen if neglected. Therefore, knowing the recommended dosage is essential. For men over 30, the recommended daily dose of magnesium ranges from 400 to 420 milligrams. Regularly exceeding this amount can increase the risk of adverse effects. Remember that more is not always better, and in this case, it can lead to more serious problems, which we will discuss later in this video. An important tip is to start with a low dose and gradually increase it observing how your body reacts. If you notice any side effects, reduce the dose or consult a healthcare professional. Additionally, it is always a good idea to split the dose throughout the day to minimize potential discomfort due to your body's adjustment to the supplement. Number six, ignoring interactions with other supplements. This is a serious mistake that many of you make when using this supplement. Therefore, before adding magnesium to your diet, it's important to understand that magnesium does not act in isolation in your body. It interacts with other supplements such as creatine, caffeine, and whey, which we discuss frequently on the channel. Additionally, it can interact with other supplements and medications, which can affect the effectiveness of both. Therefore, it's extremely important to know which supplements magnesium can interact with in your body to get all the benefits. The first is calcium. Magnesium and calcium compete for absorption in the gastrointestinal tract. Taking large amounts of both at the same time can reduce the absorption of each, hindering your gains. This means you might not be getting the ideal amount of either mineral if you take them simultaneously in high doses. Adjust the dosage according to what your nutritionist or doctor recommends, and remember to use the recommended dosage between 400 and 420 milligrams. Another supplement that interacts with magnesium is iron. Magnesium can interfere with the absorption of iron, especially if you are taking high doses of magnesium or combining it with iron supplements. This is common in more restrictive diets aimed at muscle hypertrophy, so don't overlook this and avoid making this mistake. In addition to these supplements, some antibiotics can interact with magnesium, reducing the effectiveness of the medication. This can compromise the treatment of infections and other health issues, so it's advisable to consult a doctor before using this supplement. A special tip to get all the benefits of magnesium for muscle gain is to take magnesium at different times from other supplements or medications, such as creatine and BCAA. For example, if you are taking creatine and magnesium supplements, try taking them at different times of the day 
to avoid adverse interactions. In the morning, use creatine and at night, take magnesium before bed to aid in muscle recovery. I always do this and have had spectacular results. Number five, taking magnesium at irregular times. Consistency is key when it comes to supplementation and faster muscle gains. Therefore, taking magnesium at irregular times can affect how your body utilizes the mineral and may reduce its effectiveness, just like any supplement used irregularly without regard to timing. It's no use taking magnesium at 12 p.m. one day and at 10 a.m. the next day. You need to stick to a regular schedule. When you take magnesium consistently, your body can maintain stable levels of the mineral, which is crucial for effectively reaping the desired benefits. If you are taking magnesium only occasionally or at irregular times, you may not be maximizing its benefits and will be wasting time and money just by messing up the timing. Therefore, whenever possible, establish a routine for taking your magnesium. This helps maintain consistent levels in the body and maximizes the benefits. You can set an alarm or use a reminder app to help you stick to this routine. This way, it will be easier to develop the habit of taking this supplement regularly. Number four, not considering your diet. Your diet is key to faster gains and it's a problem if you're not using it correctly when consuming magnesium. If you are already consuming an adequate amount of magnesium through your diet, adding supplements may not be necessary and could even lead to more serious issues in your body and muscles. If you want to introduce magnesium into your diet through supplements, consider this first. Get a test to check your magnesium levels and consult a nutritionist to adjust your diet. Before starting magnesium supplementation, check your daily intake through your diet. Many foods are rich in magnesium, such as spinach, almonds, avocados, and whole grains. If you are getting enough of these foods, you might not need additional supplements and will just be wasting money. You should always monitor your magnesium intake through your diet and assess if supplementation is truly necessary for you. If you regularly consume magnesium-rich foods, you can adjust your supplementation according to your specific needs. A nutritionist can help evaluate your diet and supplementation needs to ensure you do it correctly. Using unnecessary supplements can hinder your gains and even cause serious health problems due to potential interactions between supplements. Number three, using low quality magnesium. Before we continue, take a moment to subscribe to our channel. Health in Focus, where we share health content focused on muscle gain. Don't forget to activate the notification bell to stay updated on all the latest and leave your questions in the comments. I'll be responding to all comments in this video. If you opt for a low quality magnesium supplement just because it's cheaper, you're making a mistake. I know that in the United States, the UK and Canada, there are some very affordable options. But don't make the mistake of choosing a low-quality product as it can jeopardize your health. The quality of the magnesium supplement you choose makes a significant difference. Low-quality supplements may contain impurities or be less effective than high-quality products. To check if a supplement is of low quality, they often do not provide all the information on the label, such as additives or unwanted contaminants. Therefore, read the fine print on labels and do more in-depth research before buying any supplement. Research the most popular and trusted brands in the countries I mentioned. Low-quality magnesium supplements may not provide the declared amount of magnesium or may contain unwanted additives and contaminants. Additionally, the form of magnesium used in the supplement can affect its absorption and effectiveness. Number two, thinking that more is always better. This is the biggest and most dangerous mistake on our list. If you have the idea that more is better, stop applying this to magnesium supplements right now. Taking more magnesium than the recommended dose does not bring additional benefits and can actually cause serious health problems. 
exceeding the recommended dose of magnesium can lead to side effects, as mentioned earlier, and can also negatively impact your kidney function, meaning it can damage your kidneys and hinder your muscle gains. Additionally, excessive magnesium intake can interfere with the absorption of other essential minerals and vitamins in your body, which play a crucial role in maintaining body mass. Therefore, always follow the recommended dosage guidelines and avoid increasing the dose without medical advice. Stop listening to people who say that taking more will improve your results, as studies show that excess magnesium can actually cause damage to your kidneys and liver. Avoid this mistake to protect your health and optimize your results. Number one, using only magnesium. Yes, magnesium is an essential mineral and plays a crucial role in various functions of your body, especially when it comes to muscle gain, particularly after age 30 for men. It helps with muscle relaxation, electrolyte balance, and energy production. However, it is not a magic solution that will solve all your health problems on its own. Many people make the mistake of believing that by starting to take magnesium, they can ignore other aspects of their health, such as diet, exercise, and sleep. Additionally, some believe they can stop taking other supplements, like creatine, whey, BCAA, and multivitamins, thinking that magnesium alone will be enough to improve their overall body. This is a big mistake. Magnesium is only a small part of what your body needs to grow and strengthen. Magnesium helps balance many processes in the body, but it works best when it is part of a holistic approach, meaning it is used along with other supplements and a well-adjusted, balanced diet. However, as I mentioned earlier, it's important to remember not to take magnesium at the same time as other supplements. It's crucial to be disciplined and plan your supplement timing to maximize benefits. To achieve all possible benefits, you should also focus on other areas of your life. A nutrient-rich diet, including fruits, vegetables, and lean proteins, will give your body the tools it needs to work well alongside magnesium. Don't see magnesium as a miracle supplement that will replace other supplements, but rather as a complement an extra boost to improve your results. It should be combined with other healthy habits, such as a balanced diet, regular physical activity, and good rest. Only with this balance will you be able to enjoy all the benefits of this mineral. Taking magnesium can be an excellent way to consistently improve your health and muscle gains, provided you avoid the most common mistakes and follow the best practices we've discussed in this video. You can watch this video anytime you need to clarify doubts about magnesium. Additionally, we recommend another video here on our channel, where we talk about seven types of magnesium that help your body gain volume. Before you go, click on the video that's appearing on your screen to continue our conversation. Thank you for watching.